The next book we want to talk about, which is a very hard one to get, but you can actually find it online. It's called New Water for a Thirsty World. And this book talks about how we are never running out of water. And this is really important because what's happening right now, we see with Lake Mead getting low and then other lakes getting low. All of this fear that they're trying to create is basically a bunch of hodgepodge because of the fact that we can just pump primary water right back into those lakes, just like in the 1950s when they refilled Lake Elsinore because it was running low. And this information has been hidden from the public so that we can be put into a mindset or a fear state to make us believe that we're going to run out of water. And then it's interesting, too, because last year, I think 2021, water was actually put onto the stock market so you could trade it at different prices. Why would they do that? Because if they create droughts or say that there's droughts, they can manipulate the price to make more money. And if we look at who owns a lot of the water companies, such as Coca-Cola and Pepsi and all of these companies, they can make a large amount of money or profits during a time in which there's a drought. So highly recommend this book. It's called New Water for a Thirsty World, and 